New tonight, leaders in the South Bay taking some steps to help with rent control. After a unanimous vote, some residents in National City could soon be protected against high rent hikes. Fox 5 Sarah Allegra joins us live and explains what has to happen before those protections are put in place. Sarah. Good evening, Maria. Yeah, mobile home residents uh, hoping for some big changes here in National City after months of working with City Council, working to limit rent increases. Tenants who are mainly low income seniors could see some changes on the way. The whole reason why trailer parks were started were to allow low income families. Marisol Yesquez has lived at Keystone Trailer Park in National City for 30 years. She tells Fox 5 after her rent hiked up more than 20% in August, she's been forced to choose between medicine and rent. And then on top of that, obviously the cost of living everywhere else has, you know, made the problem just worse. With the help of nonprofit, the San Diego Organizing Project, the city is working to offer a temporary solution with an ordinance months in the making set to help residents like Yeskes from rising rent. We're talking about our most vulnerable communities in the region. And so they cannot, they don't have $100 extra or any amount extra to um, suddenly have to put towards rent. According to the city, this will protect mobile home owners and residents from, quote, excessive rent with a cap at 5% for every 12 months. Motion carries unanimously. Outstanding. In a unanimous vote, City Council deciding Tuesday that should the ordinance get the green light, the protection will apply to rent increases beginning January 1st of 2023. I'll add that this is not just like a housing issue, this is a moral issue. Um, these are people who very easily could end up on the street within a few months if this isn't passed. On the other side, Clay Hage, who runs a mobile home park in the area, argues this decision will only hurt the landlord in the long term. With all your arrows that you're shooting, you hit my park too. And what's going to happen is that that we're going to be have to limit our rent increases. We're not going to be hurt tomorrow, and I may not be hurt two years from now. Council will make their final decision on this uh, coming up on December 6. It is important to note, though, that this only applies to mobile home parks. Now, if passed, rent will be capped at 5% for a temporary two year long trial run. This will end in June of 2024. For now, live in National City, Sarah Legray, Fox 5 News. All right.